Here I'm going to walk you through my approach to this fracture via sinus tarsi approach. So we're going to do a sinus tarsi approach. I mark out my fibula. And I mark out my fifth metatarsal base here. And I usually take these two fingers and then right where my index finger is, the anterior process of the calcaneus. So that's about right here. So I know my incision is going to come right in front here, pulling back to the perineal tendons just under the fibula and going towards the anterior process of the calcaneus. That'll give me access to my joint line. That'll allow me to slide the plate here and fix everything. Once the articular surface is reduced, it's then fixated, followed by the application of a plate at the lateral aspect of the calcaneus through the incision site. Here's a medial oblique, and here's the patient two weeks postoperatively and four weeks postoperatively. Here's some other final x-rays with the patient now weight-bearing. Take care. Peace.